Hey everyone, it's Sara. I know I haven't done a video in quite a while and that's because I have been saving up money for my plane ticket and other stuff for our family trip to Spain. I am super excited about this. We're leaving actually this weekend, so um, as a result of more, more saving, that meant less shopping. But I did go shopping today. I got a few things for spring and summer, just like a few accessories and clothing that I felt would be great for this warmer weather and for these sunnier days. Um, I just wanted to show you them real quick. The first thing that I got was this maxi dress by Moa Moa. It's full length. It's a kilometer in shape. You know, it's not an A-line flowy ruffly thing. Um, I'm only 5'1 and I love the maxi dress trend, but I do know that picking the right one for your height is very important. You don't want a gigantic, floofy, voluminous dress if you've got a small frame, because then you'll just look like you're being swallowed by the fabric. But I really like this one because it drapes close to the body. It's not tight, but it's, um, it's fitted enough to show your shape a bit. Um, it's got this really unique looking back to it. I want to show you this. Um, basically in the front it looks like a regular wait <laughs> in the front it looks like a regular like tank top sort of neckline but in the back it's got this um, keyhole shape it looks kind of like a racer back but not really and then on the top of the keyhole shape you've got these two strings that you can tie into a bow um, in the back so this basically has a combination of a lot of different elements. It's got a keyhole in the back, it's got a racer back looking um, back side, but it's got you know a plain tank top looking front side. Um, and I just think it's got a cool look to it. I like how you can control the coverage in the front based on how tightly you tie this these halter straps in the back. Because um, I, I hate when like necklines droop really low. And you know, if you bend over, you basically give everyone a peekaboo show, and I, I just hate that. Um, so I like how you can tighten the front based on how tightly you tie the back straps. Um, I love the fabric; it's so soft and comfy, and um, just loose and lightweight and flowy. Um, when I tried this on in the store, I. I kept it on for like five minutes because I just couldn't take it off. It was so comfortable. Um, and I think this is just going to be great for summer. This was $26.99 at uh, Lowman's. And for those of you who aren't familiar with the store Lowman's, it's basically a designer brand discount store. So they have a lot of really cool brands like um, Seven for All Mankind, Seven Seven, Calvin Klein. Um, Marc Jacobs. They have a lot of more high-end brands. Free People, I love that brand. They have it there. Um, but they're usually slashed deeply with discounts. And sometimes they have some really cool funky stuff. I love the stripes. I feel like this reminds me of going to the beach on a sunny day. Um, maybe this is more of a summer dress than a spring dress, but I still can't wait to wear it. Um, I, of course, can go crazy with accessories here because it is just a very simple, plain dress. It's not too floofy or crazy. So I was thinking I could probably wear it with this flower in my hair, this ridiculous looking flower pin that I bought a few videos back. I don't know if any of you remember this. Um, I thought I could also wear it with this necklace right here. Uh, my phone's going off. Don't worry about that. But um, yeah, with these kinds of simple patterns, you can totally go nuts with your accessories. And that brings me to the next thing that I bought. Um, these really cute Seychelles sandals. Um, I like these because they're simple um, in design. They're not too elaborate or strappy, so you can just kind of slip them on like you would flip-flops. And they're very comfortable. They're just black, so, you know, black goes with everything. Um, I got these for only $12.99, I think, at Ross. And I was really excited when I found these because I actually see this brand quite often at um, Urban Outfitters. And these were originally supposed to be $40. I got these for $12.99. So 
Definitely don't underestimate stores like Ross and TJ Maxx. Sometimes they have some really cute shoes. And I think these would go great with my dress as well. Um, another thing, well, another couple of things that I bought. I went to Forever 21. I got a few accessories. And I don't know if any of you guys saw the um, fashion haul that Juicy Star 07 and All That Glitters 21 did together from Forever 21. They had this haul where they bought tons of accessories and they were saying how they love Forever 21 because you can get a lot of really cute accessories for really cheap over there. I absolutely agree and I bought a couple of things there, both accessories. The first is this this bracelet and it's kind of a cuff so if you've got really thin uh, wrists like I do, you can just tighten it further so that it doesn't like dangle all the way down to your elbows or anything like that. And I really like this. I think it actually goes pretty well with the shirt, actually. Um, it's got kind of that weaved pattern. It's got lots of beads on it. This was only $6.80, so I thought it was a pretty good find. I feel like you can wear this with a dressier outfit or just a, a fun, you know, going out with friends or going to the mall kind of outfit. So yeah, I really like that. And another thing I got, and I just love this, is um, this hair clip. It kind of has this like, these like little jewel-like beads on it and sequins. And I feel like this has such a beautiful like 1940s sort of retro look to it. But it's just a hair clip. It's so easy to just pop on in the morning when you're on the go. And I just thought this would be so pretty with my hair uh, color. It just shows up very well. Um, ow! <laughs> just wanted to give you that quick demonstration. Um, this was only three dollars and eighty cents, and I just feel like it can add a pretty, like, feminine touch, at, really easily to any outfit. Anyway, that's all I bought. I hope you enjoyed my haul, and stay tuned for my Sephora haul that I'm about to film. Talk to you guys later. Bye.